What's up, everybody? It's Tadpole Superhero, and today we're playing some more Mario Kart 8, continuing our Let's Play on the road to the launch of the Animal Crossing DLC that comes out. Uh, Animal Crossing themed DLC for Mario Kart 8 that comes out in uh, in May. Today we're going to play as Peach, and we're going to put her in the prancer, put her in a little horse-drawn carriage. Anyway, how are you guys doing today? I'm doing quite excellent. I love playing Mario Kart. It's always a good time. I'll uh, we'll put the wooden wheels on here, and we'll give her... What is a good... Oh, give her the parasol. There we go. We are going full pretty princess here. Awesome. All right, star cup time. This is one of my favorite cups in the game. Let me just check to make sure. I do believe so. This has some of the... Just, the, you know, if you could pick four courses and put them into a into a single cup, this is the best collection of four courses, I think. It's my favorite collection of four. It doesn't have my favorite courses, but uh, combined together, I like it a lot. What am I blabbing about? Okay. So, we start off. Oh, excuse me. In Sunshine Airport, that takes a lot of cues from Mario Sunshine, but also, I mean, we've got Piantas cheering us on in the airport. In the little lobby place. But of course there wasn't an airport uh, on Isle Delfino in Mario Sunshine. There was just a little airstrip where uh, where they landed for their vacation. Okay. Speaking of which, have you guys played Mario Sunshine? Did you enjoy it? Did you not enjoy it? What was your favorite thing about it? What was your least favorite thing about it? Let me know your thoughts on Mario Sunshine in the comments below. <clears throat> Personally, I, I have played it. I have not beaten it, and I don't ever plan to. Uh, it just it just didn't click with me. It just did not click with me. You know, it has some really cool ideas, but it just, I don't know. It feels off. Just from a gameplay standpoint, like, it just, it doesn't feel right. It doesn't feel very polished, which is weird for a, a Mario game. For a Nintendo game, let alone a Mario game. I don't know. That has some cool ideas, and it's 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 very pretty to look at. It's got some great visuals. Isle Delfino is a cool place, but it just it just didn't work for me. Anyway, let me know your thoughts on Mario Sunshine in the comments below. <clears throat> so anyway, we can head through an open airplane as we get inked. I got inked. We're inked. What are we gonna do? Inked. You know what that reminds me of? Splatoon! That's a game coming out in May. I am so... Oh, gosh. I'm so excited for Splatoon. I can't even... I, I can't even tell you guys how excited I am. Uh, I will be doing a lot of Splatoon videos when it comes out. Because I'm just... I'm so excited for it. It's going to be so great. We're going to pop through baggage claim here. Boom. Good job, Peach. But, yeah... Oh, man, Splatoon just looks so great. I'm so excited to play it. I hope you guys are picking it up. I'd love to play with you guys when it comes out. That would be fun. That would be super fun. If you haven't heard about it, just look up Splatoon online. It's... Oh, gosh, I'm so excited. I'm probably going to pre-order it. Uh, I mean, our, our GameStop here... It's not a very busy GameStop, so I could easily pick it up day one without pre-ordering, but... I like the guarantee, so I don't know. I'll probably pre-order it. I just haven't yet. Uh, you know, there's no rush. It's not like it's going to sell out. <laughs> All right. What are we doing? What are we doing? Turn. Oh, that didn't work out so well. Wait, that was the lap. That was the third lap. Wow. One of the things about this uh, Mario Kart 8 is that the, the racetracks are pretty short uh, in comparison even to Mario Kart 7. They're a little they're a little short when you're playing on 150 CC, which isn't a bad thing. I mean, it's a great pick up and play game, but it also surprises me. Like a lot of the times, I don't even realize I'm on the third lap. Uh, Dolphin Shoals. This is such a great level. Uh, lots of time spent underwater. Good times, good times. All right, Peach. Let's do this. Let's keep the let's keep the princess wagon rolling. The Royal Carriage. Let's do this. I think we got... Oh, there's Toad. He's an upstart. He was a servant. He was my servant. And he wanted... He wanted more. He wanted a kingdom of his own. 
He's trying to defeat the princess. All right, let's take this path. Let's just do every single path. Oh, geez. <laughs> so you can get uh, jump boosts off of those jets of, of air, of bubbles, those bubble jets. And also off of the tail of the eel, if you can hit it right. Oh, geez. Fireballs. Great balls of fire just flying at me. Okay. Rosie. Baby Rosie. We got a baby Rosie on the field. That's why I call it baby Rosalina. No. Red shell. No. This is not going well. This is not going well. Baby Mario. Donkey Kong. How am I in fifth place? This is ridiculous. I am a queen. Well, a princess. Close enough. Oh, no. No. <laughs> I, I saw the piranha plant too late. I was like, no, I need to get out of the way. Okay, now we're going to take the right path. This is my favorite. This is where I almost always go. Uh, is it fat? Oh, jeez. That was bad. That was just bad. Okay. Well. How are you guys doing? <laughs> I'm doing uh, decently. I'm not, I'm not doing so great. <laughs> All right, we got a boomerang. Oh, I dare you to pass me. Oh, perfect. Oh, who threw it? Who threw it? Yeah, bring it, Morton. Ha! Okay, grab another item. What do I got? I'm in third place. I should get something interesting. Piranha plant. I got a piranha plant. That's cool. All right, let's take the middle. Okay, come on, come on. Third place, we can do better. We can do better. Go, Piranha. Really? I am not catching up to anyone. This doesn't look good, guys. Dang it. All right, third place it is. Wow. Okay. Anyway, Dolphin Shoals. Oh, that course has great music. I hope you could hear it. Let me actually check the sound balance. You know, I think the game sound is really low. What the heck? Let's try that. I don't know why that happened because I said it differently and then I looked over and I was like, wait, why is, <laughs> why is the dial for the game audio turned down so low? I didn't turn it down there. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. That is not where I normally set it. Sometimes it, like, drops into certain presets when you hit record. Uh, I don't know. I need to pay better attention to that. Electrodrome. It was so funny when this came out. A lot of people were like, oh, drome? What kind of word is that? What's, an, what's a drome? Apparently a drome is a area, an indoor area, where you race. So it's actually a perfect, perfect course, but a lot of people thought it was a typo and were like, shouldn't it be electrodome? But you're not inside a dome. Uh, drome. So you actually learn vocabulary from a Mario, Mario Kart game. How cool is that? Learn some vocabulary words from video games. Who says video games can't be educational without being, you know, educational games? Like typing, typing with Mario. Learning to type with Mario. <laughs> uh, yeah. Drome. So a drome is an indoor racing area. Pretty cool. I did not know that. I thought it was a typo as well. And I was like, that, come on. They wouldn't actually launch a game like that in 2013 with a typo. Or 2014. It came out in 2014. That's what I meant. Okay. Where are we going? We still only have eight coins. Let's get up to ten. Let's get up to the max. What are we doing? Yeah, Peach. Cheer away. You are kicking butt. You are a royal superstar. What is your favorite uh, character to play as in Mario Kart? I know I already asked a a question for today about Super Mario Sunshine, but come on, you guys can handle more than one question. It's not that hard. You guys are smart. So what is your favorite character to play as in Mario Kart? My favorite is Daisy. I'm not gonna lie. 
Although I do, you know, if, I also like Mario. I don't, I mean, I generally play as Mario in any Mario spin-off game. Mario or Daisy are pretty much my go-to characters. Although I can't play as Daisy in Mario Party. Because, uh, fun fact, my mom likes playing Mario Party. And Daisy is her favorite. So, that's pretty cool. It, oh, I love Mario Party. I'm not really excited about Mario Party 10, though. Um, one of the things that bugged me about Mario Party 9 was they brought in this mechanic where all of the characters, all of your characters, are in a car. And you move together as a unit on a linear game board. Which basically watered down the mechanics of Mario Kart or Mario Party to the point where it's like, why am I even playing Mario Party? Uh, the mini games were still fun and great, but you don't play as many mini games, and it takes all the fun out of the board game part of the game. So I pretty much like every single Mario Party, uh, one through eight, better than nine. Although the Bowser Party part of Mario Party 10 is pretty cool, but still that that. I hope Nintendo realizes that that whole car thing just it just kills the whole game. It really does. Like it's just a huge negative, which is a bummer. Um, I mean, the the cool thing is they still make the mini games fantastic, which is great. But anyway, those are my thoughts on Mario Party. Mount Wario. This is a great track. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my stars. It's the Mount Wario. I love this. I lo oh, I love this track so much. Let's do a peach. Royal Wagon. Royal Wagon coming through. So this track is a linear track, which means it is not taken in laps. Instead, it has sections. Uh, so there's three sections, and you're going from the top of a mountain to the bottom. I love these types of tracks when they're long enough. Uh, sometimes they make these tracks, and they're just too short. <clears throat> Mario Kart 7 actually did two tracks like this that are linear tracks, and they're both set on Woohoo Island uh, from Wii Sports, which is just so cool. I love that. I love that place. Wii Sports Resort is just such an underrated game. It, like, it's not just a game for casuals. It is so freaking fun. Oh man, Wii Sports Resort is just oh, it's so good. Anyway. But this, this is a great track, Mount Wario. I love it. I mean, look at this, just so much going on. So much happening. And now we're off of the dam and into a forest of snowy trees. So we started off at the top of a mountain. Then we drove along the side of a dam along flowing water. Now we're in a snowy forest. What will happen next? Well, now we're on a ski slope. Section three, it's the the ski sl oh geez, what am I doing? What am I doing? So the snow gives you a little bit of a slippery traction with your drifts, uh, and then we have these little bunny hops, which you can get a ton of jump boosts if you time it if you time it right, or if you're like me and you just mash mash the uh, ZR button. And here we go, boost to the finish. Through these little boost rings. And we'll trail a banana for a second here. And we'll, we'll leave a present for everybody behind us. Alright, we went uncontested the entire race. That is just such a cool course. It has great music too. Which is just lovely. Just lovely. So anyway, that finishes off the, whatchamacallit, the Star Cup. That was fun. Let me know what you think in the comments below of this video. Did you like it? Did you dislike it? And also, let me know about those questions I asked about. Well, let's see if you can remember what the questions were for the day. Thank you for watching. Uh, this has been Tadpole Superhero playing Mario Kart 8. Oh, it's a great game. If you guys don't have it, you should totally check it out. It's so much fun. So anyway, thank you for watching. Uh, let me know in the comments what you think. Also... I recently started using Twitter, so you can check out my Twitter thing. I don't know the lingo. <laughs> you can follow me on Twitter using the link in the description below. Check it out. I not only uh, post my videos on there, I also post other cool stuff. Try to interact with you guys a little bit more, so 
check that out. And uh, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks.